Rose can be a beautiful addition to any garden. Any homeowner with roses dreads a visit from fungal diseases like black spot. Black spot is one of the most significant rose diseases that reveals itself with dark rounded leaf spots. An easy way to identify black spot on roses is to inspect the leaves and stems of your roses. Black spot only appears on the top side of leaves and stems, never on the underside of the leaves. As the disease progresses, the leaf area around the dark spots become yellow and gradually cover the entire leaf. Infected leaves eventually do drop off plants completely, leaving your roses weakened, stressed, and vulnerable. Some fungal diseases spread on wind, but black spot spreads with the help of water. It is important to water early in the day because the morning sun can help leaves dry quickly. Always try to water at ground level to keep leaves dry and free from water that black spot and other diseases use to spread. Once a rose is infected with black spot, it cannot be stopped without effective fungal controls. To control black spot, I recommend Dacanil fungicide, which works in three different ways. First, it prevents diseases. Start preventative treatments with Dacanil fungicide at what's known as bud break in early spring. That's the point when the small buds along the rose canes begin to swell and come out of dormancy. Second, it suppresses diseases. If black spot is already active on your roses, move quickly to control and stop its advance. Unless you treat with a highly effective product such as Dacanil fungicide, black spot can move through your garden and it won't stop at roses. Third, it protects your plants. It's important to treat infected roses to protect healthy tissue from new infection. Even when black spot is active on a rose, there's still hope.